Now, Heartland Sports with Todd Richards. Hi again, everyone. He's a SEMO legend. Former Red Hawks Logan Blomquist became the school's first outdoor Division I national champion in the hammer thrower. In the hammer throw. Now, Blomquist has his sights set on competing in the 2024 Summer Olympics in Paris. But first things first, he has to qualify for the United States Olympic trials in June and finish in the top three to make the USA team. The process is expensive. Blomquist has set up a GoFundMe page to help out with the cost. He's also teaming up with Wings Etc. in Cape Girardeau, Jackson, and Dexter. And when you purchase the champion's choice, part of the proceeds. Go to support Logan for the Olympic trials. Cape Girardeau really has become my home. You know, I've lived here for since 2016, really. And so I go back home and, and, you know, it feels like home. But when I come back here, it's like, man, this is where I've trained. This is my community. They support me. I've been on billboards here. I feel like the community knows me and they love me. And I, I want them to know it's like, hey, man, I'm still going. We're excited, though. I mean, national championship, uh, you know, that's the first ever for SEMO uh, in the NCAA uh, Division One, And to have him, to partner with him and, and have him reach out to us, I mean, we're honored to be a, a part of this trip. But no, you know, hopefully the end goal being the Olympics, of course. We'll show off that tasty dish tonight on Heartland Sports. You, you make that purchase. You help send them to the Olympics. We'd love to see that Olympic thrower from SEMO make the team, of course. Meanwhile, high school basketball on the boys' side. Benton plays Teutopolis tonight at SIU Arena. That's the Class 2A Super Sectional. Tip-off is at 7. And in Missouri, the girls' Class 4 uh, sectional is underway. Notre Dame and Park Hills will have scores highlights coming up tonight on Heartland Sports. And finally, Cardinals opening day scheduled starter Sonny Gray has left his spring training start against the Nationals today due with tightness in his right hamstring after getting a couple outs in the second inning. The three-time All-Star, uh, hey, they're expecting him to really lead the way in the rotation.